Hey everybody! Hi, We're friends. gonna wait and make sure everything's working okay. And then we're going to get started with some cool stuff tonight. Woo! I hope all of you are having an excellent Sunday. Because I know we are having an excellent Sunday. And Wiley Man over here is having an excellent the best Sunday. Sunday. Yeah, he's having a good time. All right. Oh, there we are. I was just waiting until we had Facebook pulled up on my phone. We want to hear you guys and some song suggestions. Yeah. We want to sing fun some songs. songs. You guys want to sing fun songs. Uh, we may sing a couple of those fun songs here in a little bit. Let us know the songs you want to sing. Uh, so we'll do that. But right now, we got a couple songs in mind that we thought would be fun to sing. So yeah. how about we sing those songs? Let's do it. You do it? I mean, we've been live for like a minute and a half now. So I say let's just go ahead and do it. Now or never. It's now or never. Okay, we're going to start out with... Jesus Loves Me. Jesus Loves Me. Wonderful. Jesus loves me, this I know. <laughs> For the Bible tells me so, little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. What's next, baby? Um, what about a hint on what we're going to be talking about today? He's got the whole world in his hands. Oh, fun. Okay, do it. He's got the whole, whole world, world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the little bitty babies in his hands. He's got the little bitty Wileys. In his hands, he's got the little bitty babies. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the mommies and the daddies. In his hands, he's got the mamas and the daddies. In his hands, he's got the mamas and the daddies. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the people and the huh, come here. puppies. Come here. In he's his the, hands, he's got, got the people and the puppies. In his hands, he's got the people and the puppies. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. Good job. Good job. Um, let's sing Jesus Loves the Little Children. That has to do with our lesson, too. Oh, sneak peek. Woohoo! Jesus loves the little children. All the children of the world, red and yellow, black and white, they are precious in his sight. Jesus loves the little children of the world. Okay. All right. Well, let's just get started. I'll put him back in the saucer. Okay. Well, he can go with us. He can go with us. Okay, cool. Well, here. Let's. We're going to take a trip today, ladies and gentlemen. We're going on a trip. But first. I want to show you guys something right here. This is a very tiny globe. Now, if you're looking at a globe, you can see literally the whole world. It's really, really cool. You can see the whole world, and there are so many different places. You know, this is us right here in America. We're somewhere right in here in Augusta, Georgia. But look at this. There's so much more world than just Augusta, Georgia than just Georgia, than just the United States. There's so many more people in the world than just us. And I think that's one of the coolest things ever. Me and Brooke have been able to travel some pretty cool places, and we're gonna show you some stuff from those places that we've been to. But there are so many people. The world is such a big place, and it's full of good people, and we're gonna find out that a lot of the people that are in all these different countries, have something in common with you and with me. 
and that's pretty awesome. Whoa. Yeah, it is pretty awesome. So let's go ahead. What, what do you say, and why, the man? Why don't we just take a little trip around the world, really quick? Let's do it. You want to do it? Let's go explore. Let's go explore. Come on. And we're still waiting for some song suggestions for those of you that are joining in with us. So I've got Facebook pulled up. I'm looking at your comments right now, which right now there are none. So give us some uh, ideas. Okay, where do you want to start, baby? Let's start to our west. To our west? Let's go west. To okay. the west. So if we walk west, which in this case, we're going to have to go a long way west, like all the way around the world. Yeah. Um, to get to this place, which <gasps> is England. England. Yeah. When I studied abroad, I was able to go on a tour of Oxford University in England, which is like our sister country, which is pretty cool. Um, this was an awesome place. But in England, this is a country that speaks our language. They speak English, like England, it makes sense. Um, and there are some really, really cool people in England. They eat fish and chips. Um, everybody, basically, is an actor in England. Um, <laughs> they have a theater on every street corner, and it's just an awesome place to go. You guys would love it. Brooke, why don't you and Wiley take us somewhere Ooh. else? Wiley, let's go see what's next. Whoa! These are pretty cool. Whoa! That is so cool. What are we looking at here? So this stuff is from China. <gasps> <gasps> Whoa! Your dad and I got a, fa a fan from Mount Longzhong. We climbed up this really tall mountain. Whoa! And that was in China. These are some nice formal things that you wear when you're trying to look nice in China. How awesome is that? What do you think, Wiley Man? You like the fan? Yeah. <laughs> we like the fan, Dad. But we met some pretty awesome people in China, didn't we? We did. We met some really amazing people. Uh, we met some awesome Chinese people that were there. And we also met a lot of fellow Americans that were doing some pretty cool work in China. Yeah. And we'll talk about that here in a few minutes. They had very important work. That they, they had were very and important we work. to go and help them. Yes, we did. Okay, well, let's go somewhere else. Okay. Let's just keep this train a rolling. Let's keep the fan. It's humid. Yeah, let's keep the fan going. Trip around the world. You guys are just tuning in uh, to this awesome trip. We're just visiting so many countries, and it's really cool. Also, look at how pretty the sky is right now crazy okay where are we at now baby we are in mexico Woohoo! sam and i got to go not actually dive i know false advertising we went snorkeling um if you want a funny story on that shirt we'll tell you that at another time there we go um these are visiting so many our countries and jackets awesome. Look at how pretty the that we got from Mexico. Crazy. Okay. They keep people nice and dry if it's raining or if it's super hot. It'll actually help you to like wick the sweat away and it'll keep you cool. How cool is that? We weren't in Mexico very long. We were just there uh, stopping just by a little bit. on our honeymoon, but that was still super fun. Okay. Well, let's come over here. Ooh, Sam. Where are we going next? next I'll tell you about this next place. So I had the honor of going to Greece. And we went on a cruise on to these different Greek islands. They're like a bunch of islands right around Greece. And I got this stuff on the island. I got these on the island of Rhodes which is pretty awesome. And I got this shirt on the island of Mykonos. In Greece, the people are so much fun. They are just easygoing people. They're all so laid back. Um, and we met some incredible people that were there. We got to have church with some of the people um, on this boat in Greece, and it was really awesome. Um, but man, the people there is great. The culture is great. The food is great. What a fun place to go. Wiley is eating this fan for those... Who are interested. Okay, you're gonna need to take that back. There we go. 
Okay, now let's go to our last and maybe our favorite place. Yeah, so this is somewhere that all three of us actually went together, even though Wiley didn't know it. Um, and this was probably the coolest place that we've been because it was literally to do the Lord's work while we were there. Woo! The other places that we went, we got to do the Lord's work while we were there. But those trips were just different. So this trip, we went to Africa! Woohoo! Yeah, we went to Tanzania, Africa, and we picked up all this really cool stuff. This is a little mobile for Wiley. Remember this? It's in, it goes in his bedroom above his crib. And we got these incredible carved animals and this awesome painting. Kids, what animal is that? great job everybody that's a giant rainbow elephant uh but yeah we had so much fun going to these places uh but again brooke told you we went to this place for a pretty specific reason uh we went to this place just to tell all the people that were there about jesus yeah and that was pretty awesome but there are all these countries and all of them filled with different people with different food with um different clothes people look different than we do talk they different. they talk different um they smell different everything about it yeah. is, is different but it's the coolest thing ever yeah isn't it awesome really when you go is. to other countries and you see how different the world really is there's so many different kinds of people and places in the world so much to explore so much to explore but like i said we're going to come back to it really quick there is there are a couple things but really one big thing that all of these countries have in common mm -hmm. so we're going to go to the bible to see what those things are cool let's, let's do, do it. it let's do it so i want to read for you guys just a couple of scriptures um that talk about this one thing that we all have in common uh and the first one is actually pulled up on my phone and it is in romans chapter not romans it's in psalm chapter 67 and it says this which is super super awesome may god be gracious to us and bless us and make his face shine upon us that you may be known on earth your saving power among all nations let me ask you guys this who do you think can be saved by God? Is it just people that live in America? No. No. Is it just people who live in countries that speak English? Nope. Nope. Is the Bible written in other languages? Yep. Uh, is it only countries where um, the weather is really good? Mm, nope. Now, I don't know if there's any country. I don't there's think so. But there's no country that can't be saved by God. Every country can be saved by God. And that verse in the Bible tells us that God's ways, his saving power, can be among every single nation, every single country, and every single person. So there's another cool verse in Romans chapter 12. I'm going to read Romans chapter 12, verses 3, 4, and 5. It says this, For by the grace given to me, I say to everyone among you not to think of himself more highly than he ought to think, but to think with sober judgment, each according to the measure of faith that God assigned. For as in one body we have many members, and the members do not all have the same function, so we, though many, are one body in Christ, and individually members one of another. This is one thing that keeps us all connected. People in England and China and Mexico and Greece and Africa and America, we are all so different, but we all make up one body. And that one body, the Bible tells us, is the church. So we go to church every Sunday morning and we worship God. People in England and China and Mexico and Greece and Africa, they do the same thing. They go to church every Sunday morning and they praise God, they worship God, uh, and we all have different talents, we all have different 
um, cultures, we have different uh, looks, we have different styles, we have different everything, but we all come together to worship one God. And that makes us one church. And that verse in Romans says that we all do different things, but it makes the church a better place because Brooke is good at things that I may not be good at, and I'm good at things that Wiley may not be good at, even though Wiley's basically good at everything. <laughs> but together, with our differences, we can make the church somewhere that is awesome and that tells everybody else in the entire world about Jesus and how awesome he is. So I hope that one day you guys get to travel and see some of these different countries and meet some of these different people who look and eat and smell and, and talk differently than we do. But you can always find somebody that you have something in common with. And that one thing you have in common is that we can all be saved by Jesus, which is pretty awesome. So, honey, let me see if we have any other song suggestions. Okay. And we'll sing a couple of songs. And then we might be done after right. we sing some more songs. Let's sing some more songs. All right. Let me get it pulled up. All right. Central. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Here we go. Here we go. Who has given us a song to sing? If you didn't, it's not too late. If you didn't, it's not too late. Okay, we have some good songs. We see good old Noah from oh, Hallie Horton. Yep. Also, uh, Jesus Love is Bubbling Over. That's a fun okay. one. Okay. Um, and then, oh, Zachary said, hey, from Missouri. Aww. Hey, Zachary and Kirsten. That's awesome. And Jeremy, sorry, didn't mean to leave you out. Um, that's so awesome. Okay, well, let's sing those two songs then. Um, let's do it. Let's sing God's Love is Bubbling Over. And while we're singing God's Love is Bubbling Over, Jesus Love is Bubbling Over, we need some good animals for Noah's Ark. Obviously. So give us some good animals from Noah's Ark. Me and Brooke may or may not be acting out these animals that you give to we us. No, so we will. Make them good. But first, Jesus' love is a bubbling over. Jesus' love is a bubbling over. Jesus' love is a bubbling over. Hallelujah. Mm. Love is a bubbling over. Mm. Love is a bubbling over. Mm. Love is a bubbling over, hallelujah. Mm. Ah, bubbling over, mm. ah, bubbling over, mm. ah, bubbling over, hallelujah. Mm. Ah, tsh, over, mm. ah, tsh, over, mm. ah, tsh, over, hallelujah. Mm. Ah, tsh, Okay, now we have got, oh man, here we go. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> We've got two. The Hortons are all about giving us some good comments. We need some more animals, people. <laughs> we'll start it, but we have two so far, so we'll start with these two. Are you going to help us, Wiley? Of course he is. All right. Okay, here we go. Good old Noah built the ark. Like, like God a... told him to, year first. And on that ark, he, he had, had some dogs. Like God told him to, with a <laughs> here and a <laughs> there, here up, <a>, there up, <laughs> everywhere up. <a>. Good <laughs> old Noah, Noah built, built the ark. Like God told him to, and on that ark, he had some bull sharks. <laughs> Like Thank God so told much. him to with, with a, a here, here and a, a there, there here, here a, 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 a there a, 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 everywhere a, that's pretty good good, good old Noah, Noah built the ark like God told him to and on that ark he had some. Elephants, like God told him to, with a here and a 
There. Here. Uh, there. Uh, everywhere. Uh, Woo. Good Don't old Noah built, built the ark. Like I told him to. Thank you, Jamie. And on that ark, he, he had some wildebeests. <laughs> like like I, I told him to. With a. With a Wildebeest here and a wildebeest there. Here a wildebeest there. A wildebeest everywhere. A I don't know who's it. Wildebeest. Good old Noah built the ark like God told him to. One more and on that ark he had some. What do you have? You don't have any more. What's a fun one? Flamingos. Like I told him to, with a here and a there, here a there a everywhere a good old Noah built the ark. Like I told him to, yeah. All right, we love you, everybody. We love you guys so much. We can't wait to see you guys next. Sunday. Thank you for travel. Whoops, for traveling around the world with us. We hope you guys have an awesome evening. Bye, the bug. Can you say goodbye? Say bye bye. Love you. Say bye bye. Bye guys.